And good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Music for Gaming here on Twitch, where I am not twitching, hopefully, too much. Like, back and forth. And, oh, 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 I cannot. No. Okay. Anyway, sorry, that was stupid. <laughs> I, I'm sometimes stupid. It turns out that it's just one of those things. Oh, um. Oh. Also, occasionally, I don't know what I'm doing. Ah, uh, I gotta do stuff. Okay. Um, meanwhile, well, that cooks. Let's see. I'm gonna make a couple more torches just to have them around. Oh, it's almost morning. Yay, sunrise. Okay. All right, so what do I want to do? So, I've, obviously, I've got this thing going um, which is heading over to the library which is great um, see those of you who have not been watching on YouTube uh, you should but I've got my library which is very bright and shiny actually see it's actually surprisingly bright come in it's dark it's dark it's dark Woo, light <laughs> so and that's just cool I like the. I like that they've added glass pillars. Um, now I need. What color carpet should I put in here? I'm going to put a little bit of a lounge, and I think I need some carpet and some chairs. Either red or blue. Red or blue. Okay, that I can do because I think I brought red and blue with me. Uh, obviously not in my inventory, but I've got it here somewhere. Somewhere in a box somewhere. It's not a fox. Um, huh. All right, maybe I left it in the bunker. I know I brought some with me. Where did I leave it? Where's the, where's the? <sighs> if I have to go all the way out to Horseville to go get more uh, wool, I'm gonna get. I know it's just not cranky, but it's just gonna be annoying. Okay. Well, I've got lots of white wool. That's a good thing. Guess I can cook some steak. Or actually, it's not steak. It's mutton. <laughs> All right. Keep the leather there. It's just convenient. <sighs> All right. Somewhere. There's, there's also the possibility I left the wool over in the village somewhere. Be because I'm well organized, you know, I uh, I know where to find everything as soon as I need it. <sighs> Good news is my bridge is working. So I've, I've noticed I've noticed a weird thing with my with the daylight sensors that if you're not around when they light up and stuff, um, sometimes the circuitry goes funny. It's a little odd. Okay, so let's see. E lots of feathers. Huh, got the feathers. Ah, but no. Must have. Well, if it's here, it's going to be in my house, which is at the far end. Come on. Are you running? Yeah. Overpriced bookshelves. Seriously, overpriced bookshelves. Okay. What's well, in my box? Apparently. Not colored wool. All right. I guess I'm going to have to go on a long journey. Ah, <sighs> Maybe. Unless I left it in the Spruce Castle. Which is a definite possibility. All right. Ooh, dunk. All right, well, let's 
go see. Anyway, hopefully everyone had a good Monday and is enjoying their Tuesday. It's uh, another uh, fun and exciting day, I hope. I'm happy. It was actually uh, not stupid cold here. So, uh, anytime we get down minus, below minus 20, that's just stupid cold. Oh, there's red nether warts, but no wool. I thought I brought some with me, but maybe I just left it in the... I must have just left it out in Horseville. Oh, oops. All right. Guess I'll go out to Horseville and grab some, some wool. For those of you who have been wanting to see... Uh, uh, wanting a little bit of a tour? There's your chance to get a little bit of a tour. Alright, as I race through the underground. On the... Yep, take the stop there at the uh, lava. I'm glad I have an alternative method to get around here because I'm still cranky that they broke my. Um, oops. Knocked my rail. I'm still cranky they broke my elevator. I shouldn't still be cranky, but I am. <laughs> I liked my elevator. Okay. Oh, actually, let me. Before I do this. I suppose there's a possibility I left the wool in one of these boxes. Turns out I didn't, but at least I've got more flint. Oh, still have an iron sword there. Not that I need it right now, but still have it. Okay. Well, come on. Oh, come back here. <laughs> Don't leave without me. I need you. Alright, and because I've left all this stuff all the way up here, yep, I'm just going to need to figure out the, uh, all the stuff I need to make this rail work better, <laughs> so I don't have to keep going up four flights of stairs to take top a train. Okay, well, at least I got rabbit bits. That's something. Okay. Now, somewhere here, I have... There's my horse. Obviously, I have lots of horses. Or at least a couple of them. Alright. And we're off. Nice, fabulous uh, ocean bridge. Beach trying to t take a horse in a boat. Because uh, they don't fit. Ever tried to fit a horse in a rowboat? Just is uh, just a little bit uh, awkward, you know? All right, here we go. I forgot to look. I, well, didn't forget. I was just just thinking. Um, I was just wondering how easy it would be to bring uh, villagers. Oh, it would be trivial to bring villagers over here. I would just need enough doors. Um... Because there's a village just the other side of the hill. Alright, let's see. Well, I think I'm just going to go straight to Horseville. Fairly certain I didn't leave the wool here in the Happy Valley, so... Ah, come around the mountain this way. Well, we're coming around the mountain. Where we go? 
We coming round the mountain with guns. We coming round the mountain and you dodging all the cactus. We coming round the mountain when you guns. Say, so, this plot almost killed me. I ended up digging out some sand and it just, uh, sand just collapsed out from under me and sent me into a very deep hole. It was a little bit of a surprise. Um, <laughs> I was not expecting to end up there. This is a fun little path beyond with multiple abrupt biome shifts. It's, you know, it's, you see the cliffs on one side of the path or the other. Okay. Now I suppose I could have died all of, you know, the white wool I had, but since I don't need to. I can race way over here. It's actually not that far. It's at least on a fast horse. It would stink to have to walk this, but... Okay. Okay. Oops. Okay. Down. There we go. Okay. Let's see. Okay. So let's see. I could do. Okay. So there's some cyan. Take some cyan. And I'm gonna take more cyan. Why not? Now should I take? Now, Crystal, you were saying red. Yeah. I have bread. I also have a sponge. Um, that's rocks and stuff. He's not red. And that's all pink. Lots and lots of wool. Of varying colors. Okay. Um, fairly certain I didn't leave it in the box here. Okay, I didn't, which is good. Somewhere here, there's some red. I must have brought red with me somewhere because I know I had more red than that. Huh. Well, okay. Alright, well, I guess that works. Um, <laughs> trying to decide if I actually want to spend the night here or um, wait until, or just wait out the morning. I think I'll just sleep. I can sleep when I get back to the, when I get back to the castles. Okay, well, lots of saplings. The only problem with putting my bed in this corner is it's close to the outside and sometimes there are monsters close. And that's, that's since it doesn't let you sleep when there are monsters nearby, you know. It's, it's a little bit annoying. Alright. Down and around and around and down. Alright. And we're off. Now for the long ride back to the Spruce Castle. Come on. I really should, like, put, you know, switches there or something. <laughs> to make riding through that, riding out of that gate at least, really easy. I wonder if they'd close it behind me, too. If I opened one and then stepped on the switch on the other side, would it? I don't know. Also, keep an eye out for cows. I need to kill a few of them. Oops. That's not the way my path goes. Oh, cow. 
he tried to hide from me. Uh, successfully, because it turns out I can't get to him. Let's see. There are too many trees and things in the way. Alright, cow. You have successfully hidden from me, so... You may live. I grant unto you life. Otherwise, I would be using your skin to wrap my books. Because I am a creepy librarian. Okay. Oh, that's dirt over there. Okay. For me, it looked like he was a villager lying on his side or something, which would have been really odd. Huh. I think I found a fortress. I think so. I think it just got filled in with sand. <laughs> or a dungeon, not a fortress. Yeah. Interesting. If I weren't on a horse, I might uh, explore that some more. But, as it is, I don't want to just leave my horse lying around, so... Alright, so let's see now. So, oh! <laughs> There's a cow under there. Uh, I guess uh, we'll just have to deal with it. Okay, that's weird. That's just a weird stone... You know, bit there amongst all the grass. Okay. Well... Time to take my woolly uh, wool, I guess, <laughs> and uh, go do stuff with it. Oh, cows. Oh, lots of cows. Okay, there goes one. And two. Come back here, cow. Whoa. Aha! Oh. Uh-oh. Let's see. I was going to tame this horse, but I need a free hand. Okay. Oops. Turns out swords are not the same as empty hands. Uh-oh. Um. Alright, what was it? There it is. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh. Okay. Almost didn't get my leather. Um. I guess I don't need rabbit skin. Yes, I know I could use rabbit skin for leather. But... Okay. Come on. Okay. Thank you. You don't have a lot of hit points, though, so. Okay. So now where did I leave my. Armored horse. Okay, there he is. Did I see another horse over here? Oh, I did, but... Alright. He's time. Let's go back. Oh, all that time I spent looking for horses when I was way back in the day. Turns out there's just lots of them over here. I just never got that far. Or they were never there when I was looking for them. That was annoying. Okay. Cool. Now that I have my multicolored wool. Alright. And now, I'm going to dismount in the middle. Okay. Otherwise, you end up smacking your head, and that's not any fun. Okay. Oh, you know what? I may have left the wool there in the uh, desert temple, too. Because I remember bringing, like, stacks. Well, a stack. Well, I think I've got enough. I certainly have enough to make carpet, so. 
All right. And the back it down. Yeah, because I think I can put a switch on some... Because uh, really, if I can just put a switch right over here... Some of this out. And just put a, put another minecart just right over here. Ooh, iron. Which is good because I need iron. Ooh, lots of iron. Well, lots of more than one, which is right now that's lots. Also, um, I don't need the seeds. Okay. But, uh, yeah. Alright. So now, grab the uh, little bit of... Uh, there. Fill this in here a bit. Okay. Right, so if I were to... Turns out you can't really dig stone with seeds that well. <clears throat> can't mine it out. But if I were to put a switch in and, uh, I don't know, something here, just to take all that over there, you know, so I can just hop in and keep riding, that would be good. Of course, now I might end up riding my uh, minecart right off the track, but hey, you know. Okay. Truck through my house. Past the enchanting nook. We're down. Down. Ooh, I wonder. See if my animals are alive. Aha! There are animals. Animals, I tell you. Do I have somebody in my... Oh, it sounds like somebody might be coming down to my monster trap. Which would be fun. Um, I don't need those bones. Do you want to grab the sweet? Alright. Let's see if I can breed a couple of cows. Come here, cows. Ah! I guess I don't get to breed more cows. I was hoping I could breed them and then kill them, but... I guess not. I guess not. Ah, is, are they, uh... I hear them. Alright, well... Tony, uh, I think, hears them, too. But... Alright. Well, well, go catch up to my, uh... My cart over here. There it is! Yay! Okay. So, here we go. Just a little bit of... Oh, come on. I stutter, I stutter. <sighs> I like having the rail, but you know, every once in a while. Actually, I, I think I just have lag and then when I'm in the rail sometimes. And it makes it feel like it's a little slower. Some, but also, I don't have as many uh, powered rails there as I might otherwise like. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay. We'll cook some of that. And some of that. I actually probably should have put the rabbit on this side, but that's okay. Alright. Oh, how's my fuel doing? Well, okay. And I'm sure I don't have any more... Um wool here that I didn't leave behind because I'm blind and can't see it. 
No, looks like it's pretty much there, so. However. I do try to remember to harvest this when I'm over this way. Wow. That's a lot of nether wart. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I only... I mean, I just harvested this patch and ended up with a stack plus. Which is why I've got 59 nether wart blocks, because I combined them, and apparently it won't let me uncombine them for some odd reason. <sighs> oh, well... Alright, and head back to the village. There's always the possibility some monster will meander onto the track, but pretty much there. It's nice and safe. Pretty much. They don't mostly come out at night. <laughs> mostly. Alright, um... Well, let's go head over to the head across the bridge. So this is through the super secret back door. That's not really that secret, but <sighs> at least it lets me uh, get through. I feel a little safer having this door closed. It's a little bit annoying, but at least it means that if a monster uh, does wander to the foot of the bridge, I can at least walk up here safely. Okay. Yep, that library is going to look cool when I get it finished. Okay, so. I'll have stuff. Um. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess I can. I can definitely leave the seeds here. Actually, I could probably leave this whole stack of carrots here, too. But. Okay. So let's see. I don't think the monster is from inside the castle. Okay, well, it's not from inside the library, so... I guess I'm okay with that. All right. So let's see. Red carpet, huh? Red carpet. There it is. All right. So we'll throw down some red carpet. Obviously, we need more than that. Okay. Red, red. Scrolled the wrong way. Okay. Well. Fill in the center with blue. That, in fact, um, yeah. And actually, hmm. <laughs> well, and, and I'm actually going to get some of this back when I put in some place for oops, for stairs and stuff, or stairs chairs. But if I come in, I think I'm just like. Actually, that would take eight. I'm going to do it this way. Take that back. Move that torch. Oops. I'm actually. Oh, come on. Let me, uh. Okay. Come on. There we go. I'm actually going to do it this way. This will look, this will be cool, and it will use the amount of carpet that I have. So, I'm actually going to come down blue this way. And then put red in the middle. Like this. Right? Does that look cool? Alright, I'm going to take this dirt out, which was just here to mark where the lounge area was going to be. So that looks kind of cool. And now I just need to put in some, uh, maybe some ch some chairs and some, uh, yeah, something there. 
something there that wasn't there before. I just don't know why. <laughs> anyway, that's that's sort of a nice little. Uh... Oh, okay. What if I do this, what if instead of you know I can put some blue right there and uh... okay. Oops, there, not in the middle of the floor. That would, that's just silly. Okay, so you get sort of, and then I could put, ooh, what if I did blue all the way around, do not just carpet, but do uh, there. Okay, how's this? Hmm. Because I kind of like the, I can sort of sit here, and now it's like, pillow but <sighs> hmm kind of feel like I've got too much here I want slabs is what I want <laughs> let me take some of this out okay oh actually even better even better I'm going to take this out here I've got some white wool. Um, it's definitely down in the bunker. Got some white wool down there. Let me run down to the bunker. There's space for it. Yeah. I suppose if I don't, I've got a box down in the bunker <laughs> where all the white wool is. Okay. Going down. Keep thinking I should disguise that uh, hole in some way. But okay, white wool. This will be even better. As soon as I get back up there. Back to the library. Where everyone likes to read. It's almost going to be like giant beds. You know, that was really loud. It scared me. Okay, so let's see. White. Alright, check this action out. Doink, doink. There. How's that? Maybe, I think... Ex what if I expand the red? No. 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 <laughs> I will trust my artistic uh, children here. And... Okay, so not that. But uh, but that gives you sort of the uh, loungy area. You know, look out. And... Where are those people bursting into flames? Oh, they're out there. That's why they sounded like they were close. Because they were. They were just outside the window. I should look. Make sure. Of course, it's probably a little late now. They probably all burst into flames. But, yeah. Okay. Nothing uh, spawned up here. So, <laughs> that's a good thing. Okay. I'm getting footprints all over my library. Down we go. Okay. But that's that's kind of cool. That gives you sort of the reading nook area. And actually, I could expand out like this. Unfortunately, that uh, torch is going to have to move. I'm going to put it up there for now. Okay, now I'm planning on having bookshelves to go to here, but, uh, okay, yeah, that kind of works. Actually, I could just, uh, you know, I have birch floor, no, 
Okay, so that kind of goes there. I could carpet the whole floor, but that sort of defeats the purpose of putting birch in. I don't know. All right, Crystal, what do you think? Should I carpet the floor? No. Just leave it birch? Yeah, leave it. Okay. Cool. I think what I'm going to do, though... I have a herd of llamas stuck in my tower. Uh, or what will be a tower. A herd of llamas stuck in your tower. Sure. Yeah. That's a problem. Oh, there one goes. They just don't want to leave the tower. Well, they follow each other around, too. Yeah. Uh, that's better. Just adding the extra row of carpet on the other side of the pillows gives it a little bit more of a, um, you know, flavor. <laughs> Looks a little less abrupt, I think. Okay. I still need to put in a gate over here, but uh, this should work. That's a giant wall. <laughs> Okay. Sweet. So now I just need to make more bookshelves. I don't have a whole lot of leather, but uh, actually I don't know that I have a lot of sugar for that matter. Yeah. Obviously I don't have much here, but... Um, Okay. And I know I don't have sugar. Okay, that's fine. All right, so the next question is what to do with these rooms here. Obviously, they're rooms. They're very good at being rooms. Um... But I don't know what I want them to be. So I've got that, and then I've got down here. And this comes in from the outside. I feel like I need something here. And what I could do could fill this in and make like apartments down here and then uh, build a couple of doors out actually I've got enough doors <laughs> on the bridge I just need to build a house over here if I build a house Actually, maybe almost right where that dark oak tree is. Um, I might actually be able to get some of my villagers to move into my castle. Is that a cow? It is a cow. There's a cow taunting me over by my castle wall. <sighs> where it's hard to get to. Ah. <sighs> There's also a skeleton hiding. Is that your council wall? Council wall, thank you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, so actually, so let me build. Hmm. So if I build a. Oops, that's not good. I could build a house right here. Actually, maybe not on take the dirt out maybe put wood there but I could yeah so if I could build another house here and then uh, be sort of uh, boy it'd be sort of a skinny house because I just there isn't a lot of space here suppose I could replace this bit of fence with the building wall. I like the fence there. I like, nice. the, f I like the fence there, too. I'm just trying to think of a way to... 
because the villagers stay within a certain um, number of blocks from doors, right? From the, from the village. So, <clears throat> trying to find ways of making the village extend to the castle so that the villagers will go over there too. And if they do, then they might see the village is big enough and really start breeding. Because, um, you know, the villagers really need to. I think I've only got three of them. And none of them seem to have gone into the spontaneous love mode that they're supposed to do. Very, very rare. Uh, yeah. But if they were to do that and then, you know... <clears throat> produce baby villagers that would be great <laughs> all right so let's do this um, <clears throat> so I'm gonna have to move my acacia trees in order to pull this off but yeah I do like the fence there and maybe if I build the house over here Kind of have to smooth out the this pathway a little bit. But yeah, I could do that. So, actually, do I have dark oak? Let me just, see. I might have dark oak saplings so I can not worry about them quite so much when I cut this tree down. Ah, I'll have a dark oak sapling, which is fine. <clears throat> now the one thing I'm going to have to be concerned with is uh, well the fact that uh, oh that's, this might actually solve that problem um, this bit of dirt over here is actually standing in, um, over a pit <laughs> and a little bit of cave that would be really nice to not have there or at least provide a more reasonable way for me to get down there if I want to. Okay. So I'll just take down the tree. Make sure I get all the branches. That's always the hard part with these, uh, with jungle wood and with uh, dark oak. Let's make sure that uh, I get all of the branches. Now, of course, I am sitting right next to a dark oak forest, so this is not wouldn't be too bad to deal with uh, moving a dark oak tree, but or getting more dark oak if I need to. Um. Oh, there's another sapling. Great. So I think where to put another dark oak? Oh, how about just right here? This will work. That'll work great. I wonder if that house is being considered as part of the village. <laughs> Probably. I think it's close enough. All right. Anyway, back over here. So. So let's see. What was I doing for the floors? Did I do birch for the floors in here I did some of them I did stone some of them I did acacia okay what do I want to do I think I want to do acacia that'll be good do I have any acacia blocks uh nope oh yes I do Huh, look at all those right there. All of those acacia planks plus all of this wood I've got sitting right here, right now, my very own. Actually, I want to keep that leather with me. Okay. So. So if I'm going to build a house. Okay, I think I'm going to do... 
plain dark oak starting right about let's see one two yeah right about there okay and the house can go over to right about here actually i may want to bring it back just a little bit whoa because of the uh one the giant hole in the middle of the ground let's take this out Critter's growling at me. Okay, so let's take some of this out here. And all I need to do then is just put in a nice uh, ladder or something. Oh, I was just going to carve under it, so that's okay. Cool. But, so yeah, I think I want to do there, actually. Rather than right here. All right, oh, just cut that out there. Okay, and then the house is going to come back to over this way. Let's take this out. Um... Oh, we're two over here, I guess. This is a good... Hello, zombie. Aren't you happy? Okay. Actually, I can come right about... Make sure I'm in line. It helps if the walls are not crooked. Yeah, right there. And then I can come right over to... Yeah, this way. Yeah, right there. Doink. Hello, zombie. You are loud. You are making noise right now. Okay. Oops, come on. <laughs> okay, so now... What did I have? I think those are dark oak planks. Maybe they're spruce planks, actually. Let me come. They might be spruce. I think they're a slightly. Oh, nope, they are dark oak. Cool. Well, that makes it uh, fairly easy. All right, so dark oak planks. Cool. So build the walls here. Meanwhile, this uh, zombie is going to be really annoyed because he can't get to me. I suppose I really don't care <laughs> if he's annoyed, but, you know. Okay, so there's that. Now, what I want to do here is uh, I do want to have this access. So, okay. again, a shovel would be handy. I don't think I have one in my hand. Nope. Or in my inventory. Obviously, I don't have one in my hand. I have a uh, torch in my hand. Not shovels, but they do work okay. Okay, and just uh, dig out a little bit here. Good, this will provide nice access. Whoops. Well, yeah. Provides access to something, anyway. Okay. All right, so here we go. So if that's the inner part, then what I'm going to need to do, take uh, 
put a couple of torches. Whoops. Well, darn. Oh, good. I can still get out. <laughs> it's like, did I just dig myself in? Okay. I think what I want to do actually is put the floor down here at this level. Because I'm going to have, I think I'm going to think I'm gonna put an entrance here off the side and an entrance uh, over there. So, yeah. Okay. So, that's not so bad. Get a little bit of yeah, just a little bit of acacia wood going in here. Oops. So I think my controller has a little bit of a hitch to the to the left, but on the right thumbstick. All right. <clears throat> Get some floor in. Okay, cool. And so let's see. <clears throat> so let's see, dirt. I have dirt. He's right here. Okay, now as long as the skeleton doesn't decide to come around and shoot me would be really annoying. Whoa. Okay. Let's take that out. And oh, hello creeper. You are being creepy. Okay. Seriously. Go away. Oh. At least I could reach through the fence and <laughs> pick up his, uh, pick up his drops. Okay. Um, and then the other entrance. Actually, hmm. I could. Actually, I could put it here. I'd have to put in. Uh, have to put in stairs somewhere along the line here. Doors are starting to open because daylight is glimmering. Okay, so. Oops. I think actually. Actually, I suppose I could have it go all the way through. Ooh, Enderman. Hello, Enderman. Oh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come here. Aha. Oh, good. He did drop stuff. Certainly makes a lot of noise when he dies. <laughs> so, uh, you know. Huh. Actually, you know what? I think I may, uh... Actually, go ahead and make this building one block wider. I just drop in like that. I mean, it'll be... It's not a real big deal here because I've got the room I was just uh, 
Yeah, there we go. That'll work. Okay, so obviously we need another row of acacia, but that's all right. All right. I think what I want to do is I want to put I think I want to put acacia doors on this. I mean it's a little I mean because I they get the you get the bars and stuff so you can see through them. I think that would be I think that would be cool. Uh, all right now, but if, if I'm going to put it some over here. to figure out how I want to do that. Oh, I know what I want to do. Okay. So. So I don't think I have any acacia doors built. Nope. Dark oak, but no acacia. A dark oak boat. Um, okay. So first things first, I'm going to need, need some more acacia planks. So I like make the daughters. Okay, and then what I'm going to need to do is drop off some something. That'll work for now. Drop off the stone brick. Definitely drop off the gunpowder. Yeah, I'll drop off the inner pearl too. Okay. So let's make Dark oak stairs. Okay, it's one of those things. If I were in, in creative, I might uh, put iron doors on the fort. But okay, so I'm gonna actually cut two of these out and put. I had dropped a bunch of stuff here, but. Okay. Yeah, pretty uh, epic door there. Okay. It's a door you can just drop right down behind it. So secure. All right, so just uh, slap some stairs in right there. Now, I don't know... Yeah, you can't put doors on stairs, but I can put them right there. And I think I'll put these ones right here. Uh, nope. Right there. Okay. And then, see, this will just come up along the sides here. Well, maybe not right there, but... Because I do still want to put, you know, windows and things. Okay. And actually, I think this side by this door will be solid. Because the... Oops, darn it. <laughs> the rat. Uh, okay. Oop, need some more dark oak. Now, do I want to do... Huh, I don't know if I want to do windows on... Uh... I do want to put put some here, I think. Yeah, might as well. Okay. Um... Alright, so do I want to do... Okay. Okay, really? That door is in a weird place. <laughs> okay.
Now, do they open right now? Yes, okay. <laughs> that was odd. Alright, so... Grab my... Oops, not arrows. Arrows are great, but they don't... Uh, they don't help you climb up on things very well. Alright, so... Let's see. kind of want to keep the style, but do we want to do... A flat roof? No, I, I'm, I'm just looking because I've got this is here, which then goes downstairs, and then this is out to there. I have an idea for the good roof type. Just let me have oh. an example of it for somewhere. Okay. In my other build. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. Let me try to find it again. Okay. Oh, well, can it? do that. This guy. Okay. Hang on. So, all right. As I look over at, on the couch and see what. Uh, yeah. This thing. This kind of roof. Basically, okay. it's a circular roof on top of your square building. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Now I have a rectangular building. What I should. What I think I'm going to do. Actually, I'm going to. This building is going to come up one higher, I think. Just to, uh, because I want to come this way, like this. There we go. And that's going to go there. So let me finish getting the walls built, and then I'll see what uh, I can do about it. Come here. There we go. So you want the villagers to be excited to have all sorts of new uh, new housing. They probably won't even care. Okay. So I have a rectangular structure. All right. And just to keep things consistent, okay. All right, more dirt. More dirt is needed. Okay, so. Yeah, I think this one's actually rectangular slightly too. It's one block wider than it is either way. Okay. So. So, do I, where I put the roof, okay. well, let me, let me go get some stone, stone brick stairs, because okay. I, that's what I'm using for roofing the rest of this uh, village, so, and since I'm here, boy, I have a lot of stone brick stairs, um, I've been talking about doing it for a while anyway, I think I'm going to, I think I'm cutting a door, I'll cut one right over here. Let me move this torch over one. Doink, doink. All right. All right, hang on just a moment while I build my doors. Looks like they're opening that way, which means I need to put... Put this right there. There. Okay. That's better. Now, stone brick stairs. How are these going to go in here? So they go off. Yeah, it's offset two on the farthest out. Okay. Front. Okay. So from like here. Side. Right. So here's the long side. Um, they're offset two, which I can do. That's easy yeah. enough. Um, but do they, they would stick at, they'd be at the level of the block above the, yeah, that's what they're okay, so let me go ahead and, which means the first stair would be obviously right there, upside down. Yes, obviously. 
like that. Yeah. Stick because it sticks out one. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. See if I can now inch my way over. Really? It doesn't want to do the thing. I know I can do the thing. I've done the thing. Okay. I just have to be on the top of the stair, not on the yeah. bottom. Okay, so. So I'm coming over this way. Yeah. All right. Now, when do I start going in? I guess I should probably just build out. The, the, I think going in, because I think because it's going to go out the same on all the sides anyway, yeah, right? Start with that and then make the corner. Yeah. So let's let's do this. So that's going to go there. <laughs> this will work. See. Okay, can I have to be on the top step? Now, probably not all the way to the corner because it's going to curve in. So, right, come on, get over there. Give me the target. There it is. Really? Some things are just so much easier and creative. Like random block placement when you can't see what you. Working with stairs. Okay. So I'll just step over. Whoa! Hello! <laughs> I look up as an arrow goes whizzing by my face. Um, Alright. I see your head there. Where's my bow? There's my bow. Oops. Need to inch up just a little higher. All right. Where'd you go, you bony? Might have fallen down. Well, I know I knocked him off the. He got knocked back. All right. Well, yeah. it's over there now. That is the drawback of using fences and not tall walls. Is that, uh... Is yes, there he is. Oh, I got him. And... Got him again. Ha-ha! That'll teach you. Let's see. That'll teach him... All sorts of stuff. Or he he would, at least, it would teach him something were he not dead. It's very hard to learn things after you're dead. Okay, anyway. Continue. I've got all sorts of glass up in the room up on the other end of the bridge. So, I think I'll build the other side might be less likely to get shot off my roof by stray monsters. Okay, so it's gonna go there and there. Okay, and so this piece goes off like that. Okay. Well that's lovely. You know what? This might be easier if I just do it this way. Is it like that? Okay. So, I've got the outer part done on that side. So I have to do it on this side too. Okay. Um, just while I'm thinking about it, those of you who are 
super excited about uh, all things music free. Um, I will be streaming again tomorrow. Not tomorrow. Thursday. Thursday. Totally not tomorrow. Um, on YouTube at youtube.com slash music free gaming live. Also, that's where all the archives go. So if you want to go back and see other videos that I've done on Twitch, uh, they get archived up on Music Free Gaming live on YouTube. All right. And now I have, so I've got a bunch of stairs. Now, how do these go in? It's my... Because obviously they're going to have to go in here at some point. So they go. They come onto the corner? Or they, um, they stick out of the corner? I think mine stick out from the corner. Okay. So. Let's see. So they just one or is it? Mine's it looks like just one. Yeah. Okay. So if I go there, oops, oh no, that's right, that's right, that's right. And there, which means that I should, those should now corner up. Uh, okay. I have screwed up here somewhere. I don't mind did weird stuff like that. Okay. Or do I do that? Oh yeah, that's it. Yeah, I was just missing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hello creeper. Y'all stay down there. We won't have any trouble. Okay. So, so the way this is going to work then, right, stair goes there, and right there, there, oops, come on, come on, I'm not standing on it, so it shouldn't be in the way, there, cool, actually I may need to leave those blocks there, but anyway, Okay, so, so that, yeah, and that goes there. All right. And doink. Yay! All right. And other, I still need to do this corner, but obviously that's not the corner that's going to show me how it's going to look when it's all done. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm going to have to move my scaffolding in, in a little bit because I still have to get up there. Okay, there. I think that'll work. So that goes there. And obviously I'm going to need a lot more stone brick stairs to finish this roof. Though I don't know if I'm going to go all the way domed, but because I could stop and do uh, just flatten out the roof when it's time. Okay, so let's see. Does this, yeah, okay, yeah, that kind of works. Yeah. So I'll just need to figure out how to um, see what I'm going to do for that gap, but okay, so now. Obviously, the stairs continue, but now that I have the first round done, this should be much easier. And uh, yeah, significantly easier. 
Assuming I don't fall down and trigger one of those creepers down there. This should be just peachy. Alright, let me go make some more stairs real quick. Since I'm obviously going to need a lot of them. Okay. Because I have lots. Oh, I have more stone brick stairs than I thought. What? Why are those not combining? Okay, I couldn't stack them on top of each other. I kept weird. swapping them. It was extremely weird. Okay, anyway, stone brick stairs. Oops, actually. Yeah. Change this. Door should be on that side. Like that. Okay. Great. Oops. Ow. You gotta actually land on the roof that you want to be building on. Otherwise, it just doesn't work. Okay. So that goes there. Come on. Alright. I'm just going to wait there to figure out how the corner is going to work. Because that would be... Because <clears throat> I'd kind of like to figure that out. I think what's going to happen <coughs> is, uh, oh, excuse me just a minute. Yeah, actually, you have to unmute, un unmute, unmute the mic. He's a muted. It's like a cow's opinion, right? It's moo. Um, no, that's not right. Something's not right here. Is it this one? Oh, no, you just need one uh, inside. Okay, so that goes there. And then you just need one on inside that corner right there. Right here? Yeah. It'd be probably be easier to take one out. Okay. The corner piece. Okay, so then, so how does this, okay, so turn it on the right. okay, turning and to the, just put it on, paste it on the back there, okay, and now it should, if you place it in the, R oh, right, in there, but in the, oh, okay, place in front, should corner, place it right here, yeah, it should, okay, I mean, it, it, the problem is... Oh, it's you can build or take out and build around until you get the straight part. Eventually it'll Cause it Because it feels like... Alright. Because that... Okay. I think I see. And then this guy is going to have to go... The problem is I've got... Um... Okay. Let's see, so if that goes there. Right, and then this should go there. Ah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Yay! I just had to build the stairs right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, it's just a matter of getting things to angle in the right direction at the right time. All right, so this goes there, and this goes, oops, come on, there, and this goes. All right, there, no, not there, there, geez. 
Okay. I think I got this. Yeah. Okay. And then... Of course, this one was... Uh, I'm going to have to build new scaffolding to get back up here. But... That's okay. Because that's going to go there, like that. Yeah, and I don't know what I'm going to do. Because obviously there's a little bit of a gap. Not that it's going to make a whole lot of difference, I think. But that goes there. There. And there. Oops, no. Nope, nope, nope. It was there. And then... Oh, okay. Yeah. This is back to the... Uh, get the stairs in there right. You gotta put them in, in the right order so that they... Yeah. Stair step that. properly. Okay, there we go. Alright. Now I can come in here. Take this out, build new scaffolding up onto the roof. Okay. There we go. All right. Okay, so this is going to go like this. And this, you basically just can't finish the one side until you get the corners in. Yeah. Like that goes in like that. And then, see, it goes in just like that. Okay. So, so it looks like that. Oh, hello, Creeper. Aren't you cute? Probably all frustrated, you know. Wants to get in, just blow stuff up. I'm not letting him, you know. Okay, so I'm definitely going to do, I think, I'm going to definitely, I think, do um, one more round here. So, so it's going to go there like that. And like that, I think. Yep, and it goes there. You know, if you just build it around, it's a lot easier than yeah. doing the sides first. Okay, so what I anyway, what I was um, questioning myself on is one, my ability to actually put stairs in useful places. Um, but. Uh, if I actually want to continue this all the way up to so it's domed, or if I want to stop here at about this level and uh, then just and flatten it, and I don't, I don't have an answer for that. Okay, that creeper freaked me out. I thought, oh, he's inside. He's going to blow me up. No, he's uh, still on the other side of the fence. Which, again, Creeper's perfectly ha fine to be on the other side of the fence. As long as he doesn't blow up, I'm okay with it. All right. Um, oh, well. Let me craft more stairs out of what I've got first. Okay. Yep, he's trying to be all creepy. Follow me around. Okay, so. I want to come in on the inside of this one. Over. There we go. Alright, so yeah, it's not too bad. 
with just assuming you can aim correctly, which is again always a hard thing for me. Because, you know. Alright, so let me run down here real quick, take a look. Yeah, I don't know that I should I'm, I'm so I'm looking at this, I'm thinking I should flatten it there because yeah. if i go up too much more it's i think gonna it's, overpower the building. yeah it's gonna look stupid right and it was matching materials yeah. um mine is not matching <laughs> however i think what i'm going to do is um i think i'm going to use slabs up here And flatten it right here like this <coughs> so it'll so it'll still be flat um, of course I think upside down slabs are not uh, spawnable I mean, you know monsters I don't think can spawn on them so uh, so that's a good thing Okay. Yeah, make sure I've got uh, everything over here. But yeah, I think this will this will work out pretty okay. Again, the the question is just going to be what to put in the uh, in the gap so that it uh, doesn't look like the roof is floating and that the ceiling looks incomplete. Or the walls looking complete. Okay. And see, you can't place torches because it's upside down slabs. All right. Okay. Oh, yeah, that looks a lot better. So now, I think inside here, oops, because you see it's got the. I could do that. Yeah. So I could do the stained glass. The other thing I could do is actually just build the wall up with the dark oak. Yeah. That's cool. Which I think would be better. Do I still have dark oak? I've got dark oak on me. I was just looking to see if I had dark oak uh, blocks. And I don't know if I... Oh, well, I had a dark oak block that I uh, apparently decided needed to be in the chest there. Okay. So dark oak blocks. That should do it. Boy, I've got all sorts of doors on me. I had birch, I had oak, I had, or dark oak, and acacia. All right, so. So basically, I want to just do. Oh, come on. I can do that. Oh, come on. Not that high. Okay, and I might actually go back out there and deal with the corners when it's uh, light, because I'm not entirely sure I've got dark oak where I want it in the corners. Because I might be sticking out a little bit. Some of it obviously needs to be where it is, but oops, not there. And this place obviously is going to need some sort of oops, darn it. Some sort of windows. In order to keep uh, 
random outside monsters from spawning and shooting whoever happens to be standing in this building. Oh, what an interesting place for there to be a spider. It got, uh, it's inside. It's inside the bridge. How intriguing. Interesting. How very interesting. I wonder if it just spawned in there. It might have because there's grass and a tree. There he is. Hello, spider. Okay. No more spider. Okay, well, let's go get that, uh, go get that glass, which is over here. See, you got the nice castle walls to keep the monsters at bay. All right. I think I'm going to need more than 24 panes, so 40 should probably do it. Oops, can't walk through the door standing on the bed. All right. No more monsters jumping on the bed. I don't think it could have spawned. In. Well, I mean, it could have spawned. I don't think it could have climbed in. Well, it could have gone in while the doors were open, I suppose. Because spiders don't care about darkness. Yep, definitely have to clean up this uh, little pathway here. Okay. So, glass. Okay, so... Okay, and let's fill this in here. Well, that's an interesting question. As I think to myself, self, should I make my windows bigger? But I don't know that it's going to make a whole lot of difference. Oops, darn it. Satisfying as the sound of breaking glass is. Uh, you know what? Actually, I want to do. I want to do this. I want to put torches here in the corners. I'm going to do that on the other side too. Okay. Pop up here like this, and torch there, and there, and there. Okay, now it's harder to see the effect because it suddenly became daylight, and uh, you know, daylight makes torches somewhat uh, redundant. Okay, that's not a bad little uh, little building there. Yeah, come, oops, yeah, come in, come down. Got this. I should uh, extend the path here. But uh, yeah, that works. That does indeed work. Let's see. Let me check the. Outside is looking okay. Outside looks good. Sweet. Well, thank you, Crystal, for the uh, most epic roof. And uh, what's fun here is that 
and come in and climb up this tower and see the roof from the top. See, that looks pretty cool, actually. Yep, sitting out there. All right. Farms looking farmy. So, uh, good. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Oh my. So, what do you think, guys? No, oh, you think you need to slam a door in my face. All right, well, I suppose you can do that. Sometimes I wish I had dirt stairs. Yeah, yeah you can really smooth out a hill. Yeah. Okay. Where is where is my security? Down here somewhere, I think I heard. Obviously, the golem's not going to be inside the doors there. Oh yeah, over here. They're having an intense discussion, obviously, because they've been... I've come down here often and to find this one villager and this one iron golem just sort of hanging out over here. I don't know what they're uh, discovering here, but uh, I'm very careful not to hit the villager or the golem. If I just hit the golem, I think he'll put up with it. But if I hit the villager, it'll be a bad day for me. Fortunately, the villager decided he had someplace else to be. Okay. Yeah, so I don't know what to put down here, but uh, this little back... Uh, Oh, <laughs> this becomes the cave, uh, n you know, restaurant. <laughs> Obviously, we, with the uh, desire to dig it out a little more, but uh, but yeah, okay. Also, I think this villager is lost. I don't think he can figure out how to get back up. Yeah, he's just, huh, hmm, huh. Because, yeah, I've got a couple of these places that it's like, okay, I can dig out and put something fun there. I don't know what. But here, I've got, oh, he managed to find his way out, because there's a three of them. Again, none of them thinking, uh, I think I only have three of them over here. And there should be, oh, four. I think, did I bring a fourth? Maybe I did. I don't know either. Help me out, audience. <laughs> okay. Maybe I did bring a fourth. Think we, I, that's entirely plausible. So, still, uh, here's another another fisherman, and uh, let's see. That's uh, that's my other questions. I don't know if this uh, if this hut over here by my uh, horse corral is. Uh, I think it's close enough to the village for them to farm, but well, that tree worked out okay right here on this hill. Yeah. All right, cool. All right, well, I think this uh, turned out all right. This, I think this is good. So now, 
<laughs> now it'll be an interesting question to see whether or not I end up with villagers wandering over to my castle. There is a little hut that they can camp in if they end up over there. <laughs> Assuming they don't go end up upstairs and in my uh, go, running across the top of the bridge. <laughs> that would be really funny. Okay, well. All right, well, that's a nice little house. Cool. Yeah. I think that... I think that works. It's, uh... I said it's... Just heads down. and Just a nice little place. Hopefully the villagers will, uh... Decide to... Yeah. Make use of it. Wander over to the castle and, uh... It might end up making the village that much bigger. All right, well, I think that's going to be it. Let me wander in. I think I'm going to come back on top of this tower because look down upon my domain. Oh, can't really see the villagers from over there. But there's the there's the house. Cool. Yeah. It does look a little bit like a mushroom. But it was a good thing to stop it there and not go up one more yeah. and just that would have been too much. So it would have been dumb Yeah, yeah. Alright. And you can see the library over there. Which looks really cool. It does look pretty cool. It'll look really cooler when all the books go in. Alright, anyway. Thank you all for watching. This is uh it's been fun. I will be streaming again on Tuesday. Or Tuesday, on Thursday, excuse me. Um, at 6 or 6.30 ish on YouTube at youtube.com slash music free gaming live. Uh, usually I stream Saturday. There will be no Saturday stream on YouTube this week, but I will be back again on Monday. Again, 6 or 6.30. So until then, be excellent to each other. And this is Music Free Gaming signing off. Have a good night, y'all. <laughs>